Thailand, a country rich in culture, hosts numerous vibrant festivals that reflect its heritage. Among these, Loi Krathong is paramount. During this event, people flock to water bodies to launch small glowing boats crafted from banana stalks. These floating lights on Thailand's waterways create awe-inspiring scenes. The mesmerizing sight of these lights drifting across Thailand's rivers and canals has captivated visitors from around the globe. Loi Kratong, rooted in Thai traditions, holds deep cultural and religious significance. This festival, marked by the moon's full glow, typically in November, is a joyous, thankful period of rejuvenation. Loi Kratong combines Loi for to float and Kratong, denoting small floating offerings. Such Kratongs represent diverse expressions of reverence in Thai culture. Central to Loi Kratong is the worship of Phra Mai Kongka, the Thai embodiment of Hindu goddess Ganga, symbolizing all water bodies. In Thailand's agriculture-dependent society, water is life-sustaining, providing nourishment and enabling transport historically. The festival sees Thais floating kratongs, expressing gratitude to Pramai Kanka and seeking to atone for any harm caused to water bodies. This ritualistic act underlines their deep reverence for water, highlighting its essentiality in their lives. During the festival, Thais float kratongs as tokens of gratitude to Pramai Kanka and seek forgiveness for any harm done to the water. Additionally, Loi Kratong holds significance in Buddhist beliefs. This tradition is said to honor the path Prince Siddhartha took towards enlightenment. Figures like Upagupta and the deity Vishnu are also given tribute during this event. The festival holds a deep-rooted connection with ancestry, linking the contemporary generation with their forebears. This provides a unique blend of spirituality and familial ties, underpinning the event with a sense of unity and respect. It's a time for remembrance, honor, and celebration of both spiritual enlightenment and ancestral heritage. Some also use the festival to pay homage to their ancestors, adding a familial dimension to the celebration. The origins of Loi Kratong trace back to the Sukhothai Kingdom. It is a festival steeped in history, with hints of influence from various cultural practices. This festival, where offerings are floated, is not unique to just one countries throughout Southeast and East Asia have adopted similar traditions. These mirror shared cultural practices and beliefs. Loi Kratong, over centuries, has greatly evolved, embodying diverse cultural elements. This evolution includes influences from Hindu and Chinese customs. Over time, Loi Kratong has evolved, influenced by diverse cultural elements, including Hindu and Chinese customs. In conclusion, Loi Kratong stands as a testament to Thailand's rich cultural tapestry, bridging religious homage with communal joy. Its roots are linked with Thailand's heritage, emphasizing the crucial role of water in Thai customs. Despite differences, Loi Kratong is a unifying festivity, promoting thankfulness, introspection, and rapport with the divine and ancestral domains.